hello everybody welcome back to the channel my name is jessica in case if you are coming across my channel for the very first time today please don't hesitate to subscribe and also hit the notification bell beside the subscribe button for you to be getting a lot of my videos each time i put out any new video on my channel you'll be the first person to be notified so today's video we are going to talk about an issue okay this particular issue just between Ghanaian Sadies and Nigerian Naira. Yes, someone dropped a comment on my last video talking about how Ghana Sadie, in fact, one Ghana Sadie is much more valuable than one Naira in Nigerian currency. So we are going to discuss all this here. And I have some comments other people dropped and the ones I picked from an app called Cora. It is highly important to watch this video to the very end for you to get my own thoughts, my opinions, and my own ideas, okay? And also share this video if you find it interesting. Please, I am begging. I am just begging and pleading. Please support my girl. Her name is Garden City lou she's a port harcourt based youtuber she's into street interview she asks people random questions like strangers but right now she's doing it um in the university where she go out and ask students questions about the social life what is happening in nigeria and comparing nigeria situation with other african countries please try to go and support her and i am going to pin her youtube link as a comment down in the comment section please support her and show her maximum love she's very good without wasting much time let's dive into the video properly Resources TV Ghana stated comparing Sadies and Naira is like comparing ant and elephant. So I got this comment from Cora, which stated the answer goes when you set an elephant and antelope on a track to run who will be first. The economy of Nigeria is huge but not performing. Like on a very serious note, we have good resources here down in nigeria we have plenty of them especially petrol but we are lacking petrol i don't know why we are just facing all these things right now in nigeria basic things that we need to have down here we are not having them i'm i am very honest um some people will tell me oh why are you making this video why are you lamenting all the time are they watching television are they watching this i am making an effort i am pushing out something i am not going to close my mouth if i see a bad thing i will say this is a bad thing see generally nigeria is good just that we have bad leaders that is just the annoying thing we have bad leaders now we don't have petrol like i keep saying this almost on my videos we don't have petrol and if you get the petrol you are going to get a bad petrol a liter is just 200 naira whereas they promised us 85 naira now look at this picture look at this picture this is a fuel station black market situated in front of a fuel station okay i don't want to talk too much let us um read more of comments that i got now this person stated on areas of conversion the sedi is stronger than the naira currently 80 naira is equals to one ghana cd however the fact is that one ghana cd in ghana cannot buy anything meaningful but 80 naira is a substantial amount in nigeria than in ghana you can look at it this way things are cheaper in nigeria than ghana like i said on my last video that ghana the cost of living in ghana especially accra because some people corrected me and said no it's not ghana entirely just um accra that accra is kind of a bit expensive to compare it to nigeria like big cities in nigeria we have the resources we have everything down here talk of farm products we have them like i know some states that can produce so many farm products rice yam potato when it comes to fishing give it to us but at the end of the day we cannot be able to buy all these things 
they will become expensive. I don't know if you guys understand what I'm trying to say. They will become so much expensive. Like, you cannot even take a reasonable amount of money. Let's say 10,000 Nigerian money to go to market and buy something. Like, you cannot even come back with a full sack. <laughs> I am not kidding you. I am not kidding you. Like, you'll be checking, oh, where is the 10,000 naira that I went to market with? You know, you'll be calculating maybe that you lost money inside the market. I am trying to understand their own point of view, where they are coming from. You understand? Because right here in Nigeria, everything is just going upside down. To be very honest, in the sense that money is no longer valuable. You cannot go to market. You cannot go to market to go and buy something worth of 10,000 naira and you will come back with a full bag. It is not possible. <sighs> it is not easy here. Whether they don't watch us, whether they do, we don't care. We are trying to make Nigeria better. We are fighting. We are also making sure that we get a very good leadership from our leaders and the best way we can be able to do this is to vote not only vote try to vote for a younger generation i don't want to turn this thing into war where people will say oh nigerian currency is this nigerian currency is that ghana currency is this and that you know that kind of a thing i don't need that kind of energy when you are dropping your comments in this video, please make it civil. We are going to learn on learn and relearn, okay? We are one. I remember saying that Ghana and Nigeria are neighbors. And someone attacked me. Someone said I should keep my mouth shut. I have to delete that particular comment because I was like, what did I do wrong? So if I want to come to Ghana now, I cannot be able to come to Ghana. The person said, no, shut up. We are not neighbors. Nigeria is Nigeria. Ghana is Ghana. Abego, we are neighbors in Jesus' name. Amen. Shout amen. Ha. Please, oh, don't say that thing again. We are neighbors. Nigeria and Ghana, no matter what, we are neighbors. You cannot take it away from the fact. Okay? <laughs> if you want to counter my own opinion, do it in a civil way. I have fragile heart. <laughs> Please share and recommend my channel to your friends and loved ones. This is where I will bring this video to an end. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and also subscribe. My name is Jessica, a mommy vlogger, a mommy content creator, living in Nui, Anambra state of Nigeria. Till I come your way next time. Bye-bye.